Well, the South Point showroom is ready for the Bronx Wanderers with a new slate of shows starting this Friday through April 2nd. And this morning, we're joined by the father-son combo of Vinny and yeah. Vinny. Yeah. Vinny and Vincent of the Bronx Wanderers. Yeah, you guys really are creative with your family. I know, oh, I know. Good. The weird thing is, I'm the third. His dad is Vinny the first. I love it. So yeah, the whenever they say, parties whenever they say Big Vinny, I never turn because I'm like, that's you my father. It's not me. Right, right. <laughs> and I'm, I'm 35 years old and I'll always be little. <laughs> A little Vinny. <laughs> I, you know what? Both families, my dad and mom's side, I was always the, the youngest yeah. one. Yeah. So I yeah. know what you mean. Yeah, yeah. you know what we're going through. Yeah. Uh, all right, guys. So this uh, congratulations. Uh, Thank you. you know, you always, uh, you guys have the talent to, to you know, stick around. And, and not only that, but you're adding, sounds like, some new elements. Yeah, yeah. We're like a cockroach. We can't go away. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> the buildings may change, but the show uh, is, is going on. Yeah. So we're trying to do a bunch of new stuff. Uh, we have a horn section coming this, this week. So cool. Cool. We have a string section coming this week, and we want to change it every single month. So people that have seen the show before, come back. We guarantee you, we not even we know what we're doing. We'll make it different. <laughs> we don't even month. know what's going to happen. Yeah. All right. Well, that's yeah. cool. And um, and then wh why? Um, I love horns, and I love yeah. strings. Are they? To, is it separate? They so our plan is I'm going to do a song with the string quartet, and then Dad's going to do a song with the horn section. Oh, okay. And then the finale of the night, we're going to we'll bring, bring everybody, everybody out. out. And the cool thing that we're doing is we're featuring the uh, Las Vegas Youth Artist Orchestra. Oh. So we're giving kids a chance to be on a Las Vegas stage. So cool. And perform in front of a sold out crowd so yeah I guess we like giving back I guess describe what is the show and for people that haven't seen it uh, it's basically like a public therapy session between <laughs> me and my dad yeah, uh, good. now it's a story about my dad's life and him being in the record business and him trying to manage a family it's a ventriloquist actually I'm really talking but he's going right now, yeah. <laughs> no, 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 right now. It's, it's a story about our lives <laughs> and it's a story told through music that everybody knows yeah. and uh, we promise you'll know the songs and the story will make you laugh yeah. and okay. uh, you know we've been here seven years we Thank God we still are. I, yeah, no, for sure. And, and honestly, I'm not joking, you guys. Um, every time when I hear from people, have you seen the Bronx Wander? You gotta see the Bronx Wander. We pay them to say that. Oh, good. It's working. <laughs> it's working. Now, now let's go way back when he was little. Yeah. Okay. You're like, this is a crazy business. Never gonna work. It's never, never gonna, gonna work. work. Does he? Gonna I'm not, gonna I don't work. even want to let him try never to deal work. with this. Didn't if happen, you know huh? Chaz Palminteri, the uh, actor from the Bronx, yeah. he's so imposing that he basically said to me. With the hands, take the kids, start a group, uh -huh. and talk about your career. And Keyword I mean, take, don't four, ask. I said, they're 14 and 11. Right. It's never going to work. Listen to me. Ah. Do what I'm telling you. It'll be a big hit. And I, I never believed them. We did a couple of jobs in New York and Westchester. It was a good gimmick. They were little. They listened to me back then. That was, oh, yeah. that was the yeah. big I difference. Don't listen to them <laughs> that was the big I difference. Don't listen to them and so, no, and the next thing you know, it just was this great gimmick that, and they grew up and they just got better and better. Yeah. And I got out of the way and let them shine. And yeah. The rest that's is the way history. it should be, right? He's yeah. doing great. I'm just happy I don't have a real job, so that's good. Cool. <laughs> uh, right? I know. I know. It sure beats that. Yes, it does. All right. The Bronx Wanderers at the South Point. You know, that's my home away from home. I, yeah. Yeah. I, I love it there. I'll see you it's at the great. cafe, I'm sure. Awesome. I love yes. it. Yes. Uh, so that's going to be, you guys are going to be, you're like a residency. You, you know, you, Human Nature. Uh, Righteous and Brothers. Righteous yeah. Brothers. So you guys, throughout the months, it's going to change a little bit your days, yeah. but yep. this time it's the weekend. Yep. Friday, Saturday, uh, starting Sunday. Friday, Saturday. Sunday. All right, very good. And I'm, I'm assuming South Point box office for sure. Yes. You can get tickets. Yeah. Um, all right, guys, thank you for stopping Thanks so by. Much for having Thanks for having us. Good to see you thank again. Thank you so much yeah, for having absolutely. us. I only wake up for you. <laughs> ah, thank you. Good. That's very nice. Uh, Alyssa, over to you. Wake up and put on a snazzy jacket. Yeah, right. Thank you. I love it.